Hi everybody, it's me once again. So far I've been making two videos a day, but I guess it's okay. But I just decided um, to give you guys a tour of my briar barn, even though it's like the smallest thing in the world. So I'm putting my scissors, scissors away. I don't know what it was. No, the horse went over. One second. Move that over there. I can go over there. I'm just fixing it up a bit. So, as I talk to you guys. No, stand up. So, my stable. I like my stable. Everything I made here in the stable, except for the tack, like the round pen, the round pen, the fencing, yeah, you'll see it though. So, yeah, let me get started with the thing. Okay, so here is the entrance of. Moongleam Stables, where hugging horses is allowed. Let it focus. Focus. We have this horse statue, and then these two horse statues. Now, here is this overview of the small, super small barn. My horse fell over right there. I'll fix it once we get over there. There's Brenda. Who also fell over. And then, yeah. Over there is just a mess, so we won't go over that. But, yeah. So, let's just get started. Do, do, do. Let's go over there. Whoop. Okay, so over here is, this may seem stupid, but the dog pens. Uh, we have it for them at night so they don't run away during the night. Um, this is Dottie and Belle's little pen, and then this is Trixie's pen. Back there we have some extra feed bins. So here is our tack slash feed room. We're going to move our grate over here so we can come on in. Here is our feed bags. We encourage all of the horses here at Moon Gleam Stables to eat the cool mix. But of course, there's always the vet stuff. There's young horses. There could be pregnant horses. Or if we get a new horse, they could already be on another feed. So yeah, we'll just add that in. And we always have the bags, even though we only give we don't give these ones a lot, only to the new horses, and you know. So we have the cool mix here, which is the one that we like our horses to eat. The condition mix, the happy hoof, we have the cool concentrate, and the young stock pellets. So then over here we, sorry about the shake, have our tack. We have all of the special accessories right here. Our blanket usually goes here, but our blanket's being used. We have the Western Hot Colors Bridle. We also have the Western Saddle, hot colors, and not that, and then the Western Hot Colors um, Saddle Pad. So I got the accessory set for English, so it only came with this, but it's too big for one of our horses, so let me just fold that up. Eh, whatever. And then this came with a klutz horse, but they let you make the saddle and the bridle. So the klutz horse... Horses, they have a place for the bits, so they have a bit, so I can't use this on the briar horses. That's okay. So here's the saddle and the bridle for English. So yeah, and here's the fly net head. Up here we have a shelf that has our shoe fly. Over here we have the parts of an English saddle, the parts of a Western saddle, parts of the horse, and then just to get close up on the face, we have a close up of the face of the horse and the parts of that. So yeah, and then over here is our cool mix. And that's what's over here too. It's extra. So yeah, we just fed our horses too, but they're not eating it because they already had a bit of their food. So on over here we have our cluts horse that I got and it also showed me how to make the blanket. But yeah, let me put it for a second. He's been here for about a month, so he just came a month ago, but he's a good horse. Good rider too. And then here is Belle, the smallest dog we have, but she's really awesome and really adorable. And this rope heads over to our newest horse that we just got a week ago and she doesn't have a stall yet and she can't go over there but yeah 
Oh, and this horse doesn't have a name, so if you guys see this video, please give us a name and a show name for this horse, like a bar name and a show name, for this clutz horse that I love. Here is our newest horse, like I said, we got him a week ago. He doesn't have a, she doesn't have a stall yet, so she's just lassoed up. But she's okay, she's very calm. Her name is Classy. I don't have a show name, but I'm thinking, I don't know what I'm thinking, <laughs> because she's my first classic horse. Oh no, her Klutz horse fell over. Stand up. Klutz horse. Stay. Stay! Okay, fine, just go, go in your stall. There you go. Okay, so yeah, Classy, and also comment a show name for her. Oh, jeez. Stop it. Okay. <laughs> and then here is Big Checks to Cash. He was my first... He was the first her horse to come here. So here's his nameplate. Since he has the stall that I made myself. There's his feed. Oh, and there's the feed there. And her feed... We, um... She already ate it. We don't leave it out for the birds or the dogs. You know, the birds can come over here. Horses, the horses are very protective over their food. But that's, well, he is at least. He's not. The dogs can't get to it. So, yeah. It's big chicks to cash. He has, he's the only one with a halter. But I'm going to make a halter for the next horse, and for him, and for Classy. No, Classy keeps falling. Just stay there. So there is his awesome fly net thing blanket so then over here is this well bad bad this is brenda but her hair is crazy because and she has no feet because my dogs chewed her up but i'm okay with that um then yesterday uh, from amazon i got the ipod case and then package came later that had classy in it and abigail Rider, but she doesn't really work well. I think I might try her out again, and I just might not use the saddle on Classy, but that'll be okay. So maybe the saddle's just the only thing that doesn't work. Yeah! So then here is Dottie, and then here's our round pen, and we only have one stall plus a klutz stall. Sorry. And... 